So starting off the vlog in a bad way because this dumbass right here decided to put penis and then show him the dick on the next car. <laughs> on the next of it. <laughs> No, everyone, everyone, first of all, you wouldn't have found out if this dumb fuck idiot, give me the fucking camera, you stupid fuck. Everything would have gone all good if this idiot didn't post it on Snapchat. Come down. Chill, get the fuck out of here. You enjoying your watch? Yeah. If you were holding my camera, I would have fucking let you. <laughs> All right, guys, we're at the top of where I live. We're at the top, and we're doing a little photo shoot. I don't know if I've showed this place before, but it's kind of like where a lot of car people take photos, too. So I'm going to get these photos, and then I'll jump on wide and get a 2018. Alright guys, today is the day I talk about why I did not get the 2018 GT. So I'm gonna walk myself downstairs and I'm gonna be talking to you guys about it when I get downstairs in the garage with my car. Alright, whoa. So one of the reasons why I didn't get the 2018 GT was because I thought about everything I have put into my 2016 GT and my parents and friends and family made a good points that all the money I had put into this car I was going to be putting into the same thing just because it's a newer body and a better look. Um, that's one of the main reasons why I didn't get it at the same time. That was what's holding me back was dropping another 8 to 10 grand onto the car to get it to spit flames, get it to be fast and loud. So that's another reason why I didn't want it. Now the peop I went to two different dealers. The first dealer uh, they took me serious, they were helping me out, but they wanted $25,000 down payment. I was like, hell no. Um, I'll only put that much down if it's a Shelby or a GTR. And then the guy was like, so how much you want to do? I'm like, no more than five to three grand. And he was like, oh, your monthly payment's gonna be like two grand. And I was like, nope, if it has to be the same, like $1,000 or less. So they worked on it, they said they'll call me back tomorrow, three days later, nothing, a week later. I called them like I'm gonna go look I'm gonna go talk to another dealer where my friend works at I think they can give me a better deal so like I was like wait 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 before you go like don't do anything changes I still went to the other dealer and they didn't take me as serious the guy told me straight up like you're making a mistake what that money you're putting down just pro charger or Kenny Bell it so that's going to something else now I am gonna be building the whole 2060 Mustang different now I'm getting racing seats, uh, new steering wheel, uh, new stitching, painting the front bumper, uh, new intake and this camera's heavy New intake and tune, and uh, maybe down the road of this year I will be boosting it because I don't want to get rid of it anymore. I'm really glad I didn't get rid of it because I would have regretted it big time now that I look at my car. I mean, hopefully my cat doesn't get out because he sleeps in the garage because he's a big mess. I mean, like, the way I have my 2016 set up, it's just incredible. Like, I'm not even done with it either. I'm changing the rims sooner too. Yeah, definitely would have regretted it. I'm also really glad I did not throw this away. This is really garbage, but I'm gonna use it for today because this thing is heavy and I'm about to do something to my car because I went to a car meet last night, but I did not record it because it was a parking chill and it was boring, but yeah. So I have my dealer plates on when I go to car meets, so cops don't give me a hard time. But whenever I'm not at car meets, I'm always rocking the other license plate that my girlfriend bought me. So I'm gonna put it on right now. Jesus Christ. Well, also, I don't think this is meant for a license plate holder, but I gotta have that Brazzers. Come on. There 
go. Also, okay, so there was my discussion about the 2018 and why I did not get it. So if you guys don't want to watch the rest of the video, just close it. If you guys do, I'm going to think of different ideas to keep this video longer because I don't want to make it short. Like I said, I'm running <coughs> out of ideas, so just give me time. I'm working on a lot of things. And my boy comes back in four days, so we're going to be doing some crazy back thing, and I'll show you guys when it's done. Alright guys, so if you have made it in this far into the vlog after my last scene of talking about um, about the 2018 Mustang, today is a Cars and Coffee in Huntington Beach, and I'm going right now. Might get a little, there a little bit late, but it ends at four, so it's all good. It's not any ordinary Cars and Coffee. Um, Manny Koshman, I don't know if many of you have heard of him. Uh, it's a Koenigsegg, Koenigsegg Agera meet, kind of like all hypercars, Lambos can pull up, basically any kind of exotic hypercar, and he's taking his first, the first Phoenix I'm going to see in my life, so I really want to go look at this car, and um, there's going to be other cars, like one of my friends texted me, the CEO is going to be there, so it's going to be a really awesome meet, so I can't wait to get there and start recording for you guys to see these hypercars, because I'm lucky dying to see them, so I got to get ready and then head out. Alright guys, we just made it to Huntington. Holy shit. This looks nice. This 
Ferrari looks so good with these red rims, and then that like highlighter events are looks just so damn good too. And honestly, it just keeps getting packed and packed. Since my parents are on the market for a Range Rover, I think they should get this one. And down. This is fucking nice. I would show you guys the Regera, but there is no way I'm gonna go through all that. So this will do for now. Babe, this is the one I cruised with. The inside's so nice. Right, babe? Yes. <laughs> Alright guys, so we're done with the meet, or the show. It was really fun. And my girlfriend is a savage because she literally put me in front of everyone to go look at that agara for you guys. So, shout out to my babe. <laughs> and also for buying me cookies, so I'll pick up the vlog when I get back home. For this Cobra, sure does make sense. Oh shit, it's on. This thing's fucking beautiful. Yeah. I just finished taking a picture next to this bad boy. Oh God, man, I miss I miss the guitar we had. I'm not gonna lie, the gray looks pretty good, huh? Silver. Put some on. Oh my God. I 
fan I fangirl over these cars. It was an awesome day today. Sadly, I had to go back home. But this is one for the books. So it was really fun. All right, guys. So this is the end of the video. But I'm actually putting this in like the first or third clip. Uh, make sure you check my uh, description because I am doing the giveaway at 1K. Uh, check it out, that way you guys know what to do to get that 1K giveaway. It's worth it.